All right, Amazon Kinesis. So uh, the main thing to keep in mind about Amazon Kinesis, we're going to have a quick overview just now, but just keep in mind right off the bat that Kinesis is for real-time processing of a large streaming data sets. So whenever you see large streaming data sets and real-time processing on the exam, that's Amazon Kinesis. Now, a bit further, uh, it uh, contains actually a few services inside. So it's a group of services. Uh, first one is Kinesis Data Stream. Second one is Kinesis Data Analytics. Third is Kinesis Data Firehose, and final one is Kinesis Video Streams. Now you probably won't even need the Kinesis Video Streams in any way for any of the AWS exams. Um, and I'll just you know, provide a quick overview of how the rest tie in. So Kinesis Data Streams can ingest data from lots of different sources that are real-time streaming uh, data sources. So for example, gaming, uh, data or s data from your servers or data from IRT uh, devices or data from website click streams or data from social media feeds and so on. Lots of different examples. Uh, all of these, as you can imagine, are streaming data sets uh, and they can be quite large. And that's why where Kinesis comes in very, very handy. Now from Kinesis data streams, you can put all that data into Kinesis data analytics and analyze it right on the fly. So it's real-time analytics. Uh, also, you can put it into Kinesis Data Firehose and you can then, what, what Data Firehose does is it puts it into uh, other locations. So for example, you might want to put it into an S3 bucket or into Amazon Redshift. So we go, that's a high level of Amazon Kinesis. Here's a quick summary of what we discussed and I look forward to seeing you back here next time. Until then, enjoy the cloud.